comment, subscribe, leave a like. <sighs> they don't pay me enough to stick my hands in fish guts all day. She's a bar fetched in here myself. The last time I clicked here and the game crashed. So let's see if it will if it uh does that again. Again, comment, subscribe, leave a like, help me reach YouTube monetization threshold. Valentina needs to cut us a break. Craft, one batch. She's a real one minute starting in the butt. now. You didn't hear from me, but super. Isaac Gorov's got her own Aurora deals going on. Shift complete. All those years of college, totally paying off. Can this wait? I need to wash the fish smell out of these clothes. Yuck. Always nice seeing new faces. Another day, another shift. Oh no, new coordinates. I am so clumsy. Get it, check it out. Take care, Robbie. <laughs> Not to be so secretive anymore. What are you talking about? Let's keep this relationship simple. Out. I'm up for doing this again. Bye. <laughs> oh, la, 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 la. I never thought I'd be getting paid to work in a drug lab. Frank Rennix all in a twist because his robot got vandalized. We had a good laugh about it back at the station. <laughs> Another little activity for Neil. Why one? I'm not really liking this quest that much. There's no action or any meaningful activity, it's just making these drugs, which is boring, going back and forth. It feels like a fetch if quest type of email, it could be an email kind of quest. Like it could have been an email, that's how this quest 
It's getting pretty late. Um, what time is it? Picking things up, picking up there, it's just, it's not fun. You get more immersive, but you need to do deliveries for in cyberpunk packages and do it off in the Dropbox. It just felt more fun, it's more immersive. Websites Getting are there, place for talking, these days. the enemies, how they All attack you, to talking, help. just standing here and talking, and being close up on your face, just more <laughs> Oh, But, it is what it is. So, from now we're gonna go over to the... It's so, so dirty, man. I know it's a fishery and it's all time. Neon. Ugh, just look at the floor. Water is leaking. It is supposed to be some cyberpunk hit. And they're supposed to have money. And yet, it's so dirty. I don't think they'll at least keep, the, keep up their streets. Pick the leaking roofs. Even if you don't have everything as citizen, at least the infrastructure will look good. Are you working toward that next technological leap? Then let Reugen Industries help you get there. Fill out an application today to become part of the most advanced technology corporation in the settled systems. That's just not Reugen Industries. I've been here, there's leakage. And it's right next to the Union Industries. I mean, this corporation can't be as rich as it seems. It feels small as much as this corporation and companies. They feel small time. Some days, but... You could... look like you could use a drink. Hell, we all could. See, him talking like this from this angle doesn't seem so bad. It looks fine. It's just when they're close up. It just makes them like get bored and dizzy. But looking around here it looks good. I like the way it looks. You know, it's enjoyable. But at the same just time, too much of it like in Atlantic in City. Open, I mean right? New Atlantis. It just feels sterile. Move along. You look like you could use a drink. Hell, we all good. You know about the new arrangement. One day Bayou will slip and everyone he has bled will get revenge. But, for now, it's a lot safer, easier, but 20% of my, of our, earnings, hurts. You keep this up and we will both be living large. <laughs> Let's go visit the 
games. Not too impressed with the drag operations, feels very... Still in fuel emotion-ish. Hey there, friend. Need something? Dual Scots has a full line of equipment and... Scram, I'm on Jebby. That does it definitely needs to help. Weightlift. Ebside's a bad place for tourists these days. Stand around here all day, right? You want the stuff or not? I'm still interested, but you're asking almost double the going rate. What? You think this stuff falls from the sky? Look, I've bought Aurora on the street before, and I've never paid this much. Indeed. Still cheaper than buying Indeed. it at the Astro Lounge. Now, this is the last time I'm gonna ask. Then I'm walking away. Do you want this stuff or not? So. Fine, fine. I'll transfer the credits and you can leave it in the usual place. I enjoy selling illegal oil. I really need to stop hanging out with the website. Okay. Why are you telling me? Ooh, excuse me. Telling me a total with a stranger. Hey, get away from me. Okay, I will. Okay. Okay. Love the vibe in this city. What are you looking at? This? This is Ebside Striker's turf. Only the upstairs. Don't bother my customers. Fine, upstairs. That's gang territory, got it? Here. You're failing badly. Testing. Testing. You are really, really weird. And coming from me. You? You trying to scare me, you're failing badly. <laughs> yeah, back in the day, you would never. Ugh. Back in the day? What yeah, do you mean? It used to be people were afraid of the strikers. We yep. had a name, got it? Not now the disciples got us penned up in this lousy okay. bar. Andrea. That's your problem. Fine, I'm fine, on. fine. This beautiful establishment. Andrea, Andrea. Do you Andrea. have anything else, or are we done Good with boy. this? Names. Whatever this is. You're here, Andrea. Oh. Uh, gang. To talk to. Chris. John. Can you tell me about the abstract strikers? What are the disciples like? I guess I should get some information. Some this place. Okay. Disciples like. I mean, the strikers will rob you blind, and if you back us in a corner, you're gonna bleed. But the disciples? Psh, total nut job animals. They torture people for kicks. And the only people that kept them from getting out of control? Us. And now we're all but ruined. Tell me about the F side strikers. We were one of the big dogs. We could take what we wanted and no one gave us shit. And Briggs? Total class act. Not a psycho like the disciples. Now look at us. 
Hello? Hello? You're talking to me like I'm right here. <laughs> if you're gang, I need to talk to the person in charge. So you stroll in here and want to meet with Briggs? The nerve. Maybe you should meet with the business end of my shiv, huh, tourist? No blood in my shop, Andrea. I am this close to tossing the lot of you out on the street. Fine, fine already. You're lucky. Only way you see Briggs is if you, uh, want to join the upside strikers. They I do. What's so funny? <laughs> oh, nothing. Joining us now is great. People are banging down our door to go down with this ship. Briggs, and I'll think about joining. You know, I'll just do that. Right now. This ought to be good. Sure, let's go meet the boss. Who is pretty good? You want the good stuff? Try somewhere else. You good? This. If I only have four Someone members. Says they might want to join. No one really recruit. Losing. Been a while. Strikers right? look out for one another, right? Savage says we can't go killing people around here anymore. Can't. We shouldn't be doing that anyhow. We should be civil. Be different you from the disciples. Join us? We're a gang. You understand that, right? Not some daring adventure bullshit you can brag to your friends about. We steal, we mug, we kill if we have to. People that come to us have usually run out of options. So are you really interested? Why not? I'm interested in joining your gang. I'm not sure. I need to know for more first. I'm only here to deal with the disciples. They're a menace. There was a time when we were the only ones that kept those psychos in line. But I'll get to that. Let me tell you about us. What makes the Strikers different is we're family. It's us against every goddamn Evil. thing the world can throw at us. But with hair. If you're in, we'll go then through Evil hell and back hair. for you. Okay. It's been a little too much of that hell going round. Vogel, not the time. It's, we do everything your we can name, to Briggs? make sure everyone's got a roof overhead and fish that's in their belly. Give you first and last I name. prefer we fleece you know, them right the not kill them. Better for everyone in the long run. But you do what you gotta do. To sign me up then. I'm not interested. How do you keep the gang from killing people? Why? Did you consider killing people? Ebside is where all the loser and sad stories end up once Neon and Administrator Bayou has used them up. Yeah. Surviving here ain't easy. Sometimes That's blood's got to flow just to get food based on your plate. Understood. But we only take what we have to. It's true to buy you. It's not just a drug dealer. He's also the dude in charge. So I'm assuming is he also like the leader of Reunion Industries? Is that a separate entity? I'm not sure. We will find out. I'm not interested. Find me up. Not so fast. I gotta get to know you first. What would you bring to the Strikers? He's nuts. He's nuts. Comes and leaves so many credentials to be for themselves. 
No offense, but I'm smarter and more competent than anyone you've got. They call her the path for the settle citizens. You need minimal problems to look at me. Let's go. Now you are speaking my language. Good. I'm not sure what your game is, but if you really want to join, there's a test. You're going up against the disciples. Everyone in Ebside's been chewed up and ground up by Neon. This quest seems a bit more fun than the drug hard. dealer one. It's a line The quest. disciples are maniacs, pure it's just and simple. Send the test to the is email to quest. Who has been arming those nuts? It seems like a worthwhile quest. Grade hardware. So we'll see how it ends. We'll judge me until the end, but that's just my feelings right now. So we will see. Um, do I need to take a test? I'm not sure you're about your gang yet. I'd like to end as many disciples as I can. If you're a striker, it means the disciples are going to come after you hard. Yeah. But you do this, we know you can hack it and you're willing to risk your neck. Thank you? Appreciate you. Not sure about your gang yet. That even make a difference. I'd like to end as many disciples. We're fully in alignment there. There's a warehouse they use. One of our friends said there's a slate there that has the info we need. Well, that's my job. I was going to go in and make them pay. You want it? Too bad, Vogel. You go in there, and it's a bloodbath. I want someone that can snatch it from them. Ideally with them never even knowing it happened. Consider this your audition. Try not to get killed, new fish. Can't about you're actually slate. going to focus do this. on that. Don't break a leg. <laughs> yeah, yeah, catch you later. I hope you aren't here to cause any trouble. New customer. Bienvenue. Before you order, I have two simple rules you need to know. Oh, this is my place. That means everyone in here is under my protection. Uh, you don't Madame Sauvage. Them, they don't mess with you. You're frozen. You're frozen, Madame Sauvage. What the hell's with this game? Okay, that was weird. Uh, I thought I was gonna crash again. If you're buying drinks, you better have cash. Man, this game's Madame still Sauvage unstable. does not offer credit. Even at this point, seriously. Come on, Bethesda. So amateurish. Completely understood. Finally, someone who listens and does what they're told. A rare commodity in Epsai. I like you already. So, what can Madame Sauvage get you? Have you come to try Velocity, perhaps? Or do you... Velocity, what's that? It's nothing less than heaven in a glass. As though the universe itself was resting her lips on yours. My own personal creation. What if I'll look for information? Do you want information? Go read a book. You want a drink? Talk to Madame Sauvage. Sauvage. That's how things work in my place. Sauvage. Madame Sauvage. Nothing for me right now. Oh, <coughs> then I must attend to my other customers, Mon Ange. Perhaps we'll speak again. How did you end up opening a bar on Neon? Unfortunately, that will have to remain my secret for now. It's safe if the identities of the involved parties remain anonymous. Let's just say I was owed a substantial debt, and the bar was how I got paid. And leave it at that. We'll see you again soon, yes? Perhaps. Not entirely sure, madame. Neon treats you well.
Security's got its eyes on Saburo Okadiko. He has trouble for the status quo. All right, all right, all right. All right. Talk to Saburo Okadiko. Man, just walking around, you get all these activities. By hearing this conversation, interesting. this once and for all. Velocity or Chimera? You kidding? Chimera, all day. Why do you think I'm here? I don't know. Chimera's nice, but Velocity, that will get you hammered. See, you just proved my point. Down your third velocity and you're out cold. By the third Chimera, you're floating on frickin' cloud nine. I don't know about you, but that's where I'd rather be. Yeah, I guess you're right. Where the hell did Micah learn to mix a drink like that anyway? Is Madame Savage ain't gonna be Let's happy about y'all comments. Gifted. Micah knows how to make a drink. Ready to relax? No, Micah. I like Welcome. Coming. Are you Please, Korean? Make yourself forget. comfortable. No, Korean. I can offer you a drink. Or perhaps you're here seeking access to our members' lounge. Where you can enjoy your Aurora experience in peace. You guys sell Aurora too, I thought the only place was the Astral Lounge, damn. Can you tell me more about this members lounge? Customers choose our lounge because they desire a more relaxed and sedate journey as they experience the joy of Aurora. We have no blaring music, no crowds, no chaos. The mood here is specifically crafted to allow a full range of mindful self-exploration. Sorry, no. Aurora cells are only permitted through the Astral Lounge. We simply provide a safe haven for you to enjoy it in peace. The hell, the same thing. If you desire thing. access to the lounge, you can purchase admittance for a completely reasonable. Otherwise, you're welcome to relax. Listen to our music and perhaps enjoy a chimera. Probably like a lighter version. I think I'll pass on the membership for now. What's chimera? It's a specialty alcoholic beverage only served here at Euphorica. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Not only will you be able to experience one of the most exclusive Aurora lounges in Neon, you also have access to our private bar. The bartender down there is a personal friend of mine, and he sells some rather unique items. Okay, I'll buy membership. A wise choice. Here's your access key. Please let us know if anything in the lounge interferes with your comfort. If you need anything else, please, don't hesitate to ask. Enjoy your drinks. Care for some Aurora? Please, we got it. What's up? Hey there! Hello there! On behalf of Euphorica, I welcome you to our member's lounge. Cute. I'll be happy to provide whatever you need from our private bar to enhance your experience. Can I get you anything? Some Aurora, perhaps? Yes. The Amiga told me a work can only be bought at the Astral Lounge. <laughs> yes. Well, <laughs> due to the extreme exclusivity of the Members Lounge, we like to keep the fact that we offer Aurora <clears throat> confidential. You can rest assured that purchasing Whoa, Aurora from lips, this establishment dude, it gets is dark not when you only change safe, it. It's completely legal. Aurora is exactly what I had in mind. Excellent. We have plenty for purchase. We also offer an assortment of beverages, so feel free to browse our selection anytime. 
What did you end up here, Kiyu? Begging your pardon, I find that fraternizing with the customers can lead to problems. I prefer my private life remain my own. No offense intended. I can respect that. Thank you. Let me know if I can help. Certainly. Good thing out. Uh... One Chimera, ten percent persuasion chance for three minutes, fifty percent damage resistance. Mm. Plus one hundred damage resistance. Wow. You're welcome to sit back, relax, and enjoy your time here. Care for another Chimera? Sure. Thanks, Micah. Now keep them coming. It's been a rough day. Take it easy. relaxation today. Perhaps I could interest you in a visit to the members now? Yeah, wish I could, but I can't swing that right now. Understandable. In the meantime, please let me know if there's anything else you need. And the door is open. Those chimeras really pack a punch. Yes, they do, citizen. of this place. Sure. Thanks, Micah. Now keep them coming. It's been a rough day. Yeah, if you're in need of some extra relaxation today, perhaps I could interest... Call me, sir. Cornered converted breech rear shotgun. Long barrel laser sight reflected compositor. Fire rate 6, 10 range accuracy. Rounds mag, 150 damage. Damn, bruh. Reflex. Sight, high powered binary trigger. Penetrator sounds. Shattering breakthrough, even the strongest of armor. Damage increases. Deals double damage when targets is full belt. Randomly deals poison damage when it's the target. Nothing beats getting zoned in the members' lounge. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, I guess I missed shot. Probably nothing, right? Come on, pull yourself together. Right? In space? Just... So come on in. I wasn't doing anything. Watch them have a monster starfield called survival mode where they reinstate the features that Death already had made but then disabled regarding like survival on planets, the weather conditions and their effects on you and stuff, radiation and whatnot. Do what it takes to survive. You're if the disciples spot you, they're gonna attack straight away. Are the strikers safe here? Madame Sauvage is a serious player in Ebside. For previous favors rendered, she's protecting us. And even the disciples won't go against her. For but now. You take one step outside, and all bets are off. Yeah, but that's only for now, buddy. We'll see what happens you know. <coughs> later on. How'd you end up in charge of the strikers, buddy? How did that happen? I had another life, but I lost it all. Taken from me. Vogel and I were cast out on the street. We couldn't find work after months. Things got dark. So crime was the only option. We picked up misfits and unfortunates from there, but 
All of them fighters. Willing to do anything it takes. Just how bad are things? The disciples have got the numbers. They've got the guns. What we have left are the diehards. But we are a family. We genuinely care about each other and have each other's backs. So, we may be down, but we are not beaten. What happened to your nose, bro? Someone punched it. I got the slates, no deaths. <laughs> so you did the job, and nobody had to die. I did have to run that towards the end, because I got caught in their shooting So me. you're in. Everyone thinks the Ebside Strikers are out for the count. But now that we know where the Disciples are getting their guns, I feel the tide is turning. Go ahead, go help. Let's take this slow. I'm not sure about you. I thought you were in dire streets. As soon as I realized that the Disciples had sniper rifles and assault rifles, I ordered everyone to go to ground. But we can't keep it up forever. All we need to be back in the game are weapons of our own. I'm point you also out manned as well. Trying to score points with the boss. <laughs> Smart play, new fish. You might want to say hello to the rest of the gang. They should be friendlier, or I'll make them friendlier. After you take some deserved R&R, &R, hit a hatchet for any gear you may need, and a job I got in mind for you. Sarah Fildburn. See Mayor Carr read about a job. Speak to Hatchet. Side striker uniform, baby. <clears throat> Dangerous. Can't really see much, but it's not everything. Seriously, Starfield. Striker mask wear. Apparel. Fifteen, fifteen, five. Suit also gives us just because that way it looks cooler. Space suits alone don't look that cool. I can still technically wear this, I guess. Exerting yourself is a tough thing since you're not venturing alone, but more when adventuring with other companions. More when 
adventure with other human companions. I can go with Vasco. You really need your alone time. Exerting yourself uses less oxygen when adventuring alone. One more adventure with other human companions. So I guess adventuring alone with Vasco. With adventuring with Vasco counts as adventuring alone. Neon's a living thing. And it feasts on our pain. Huh. So you survived. Andrea thought Briggs wanted you dead, so he sent you away. Andrea was wrong. Not sure to thank Andrea. Andrea does what she has to. Respect that. Everyone is hard because they have to be. These streets and alleys are all I know. They chew up the weak. They leave them broken or dead in the gutters. So don't be weak. Good pet talk there. I know it is hard here. You grew up here all alone? Oh yes. Every day a different struggle. To stay alive, to stay good in the head. But the Strikers and Briggs took me in. Gave me a family. I will do anything to protect them. And I mean anything. Good pep talk. You are funny. Funny won't keep you alive. Having dead so eyes won't either. Is, we let the streets know the strikers are back. We have signs. Signs that indicate our turf. Hacking the signs is easy. Getting to them or fighting any disciples there? That is the challenge. Briggs said he prefers no blood. But I say make the disciples bleed at every chance. Just point the way then. Here are three locations. Good. If you need things too, I can hook you up. It's my good luck. Can I get you something? Don't sell it.
do you ever hear that one? No, it's beautiful. Step through the door of the outfitters. Are you working toward that next technological The hyper Eugen Industries. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own the settled system. Uh, what do we have here? Like decided to drop by on Neon and do a little vandalism, huh? Shit. There's a steep fine for that. Zero tolerance. Tell you what, you pay the fine now, and I'll let you off with a warning. Or things are going to get messy. Shit. Maybe. But as soon as you started putting up a striker gang sign, that crosses the line. I mean, if you want to embarrass yourself, go right ahead. Yeah, not falling for Easy. Maybe this doesn't have to get ugly. You're on orders. Let's just help up if something happens. Not at all. I wish it didn't have to be this way. No way. I'm done talking to you. Shit. Enjoy your stay on Neon. Everything good? That's shit. Nothing to report? Nope. Nothing. <laughs> Pretty slow day, huh? Core Kinetics isn't the only game in town, you know. Frank. If you're here to buy, take a look around the shop. Frank Just Rennick. keep your hands where I can see. That's awful, way. I don't want any trouble. I think coming to the... The other day, Sticks, uh, I met a miner from Gazal. If I have to eat fish for dinner one more time. Not him. 
Oh yeah, I agree. Feeling. This looks like solar panels, maybe? Powering everything? down there. Well, I do all the work. You've really kicked the hornet's nest. Good. Andrea's running point on grabbing the gun stash. I need you and Vogel to keep the disciples off balance. So we're finally doing this? It's time, Vogel. The gloves are off. Both of you, keep the collateral damage down if you can. But it's do or die. This is what I signed up for, to take down the disciples. Then today's your lucky day. You two coordinate whatever you need to. I have a request. I know this is asking a lot. Newell's Goods has some armor. Not mil-spec ranger gear or anything, but better than the cast-off clothes the strikers wear. So if you could, well, spring for some armor upgrades. Maybe convince Newell to sell it to us. I'll see what I can do. All the strikers owe you big time. Any credits it costs, I promise we'll pay you back. We Now's the time for the strikers to make the disciples will pay with interest. The strikers. What can I get you today? Adam, don't you have a business to run? Oh, I have up zoned here. out of my no mind right now. Fully stocked and ready to sell. Welcome to Newell's. If you're looking for any specific goods, Rosa and I guarantee we'll beat Sieghart's lousy selection every time. <laughs> Sounds like you have a problem with Sieghart's place. Sieghart, what's that? Who's Rosa? Rosa Newell <laughs> is my wife. We own this place together. Sieghart? Sieghart's outfitters? Oh, come on. You don't have to pretend you haven't been to his poor excuse for a store off of Bayou Plaza. Healthy competition is one of the cornerstones of owning a business. I understand that. But when you're dealing with a snake like Seagert, normal commerce practices go right out the window. 
That man has absolutely no respect for the business community on Neon. He skips merchant meetings and refuses to participate in any of our group buys. Worst of all, he pays off Neon security to keep his place safe. How do you keep your place safe? By standing up to the lowlifes who come in here expecting me to just hand over all of my money. I refuse to be run out of business or be forced to pay protection. And what kind of merchant meetings are you talking about? A lot of the merchants in Neon belong to a small merchant's alliance. It's nothing formal. It's just a bunch of us getting together to air our grievances and watch each other's backs. Maybe you should mind your own business. For all you know, you don't have a choice. Yeah, sure. If all you care about is yourself. Every payment Seagert makes validates Neon Security's corruption. He's setting a bad precedent that many merchants are forced to follow. Anyway, sorry. I know I can get a little intense about these things. If you'll forgive the outburst and have a look around, I'm sure you'll find something you might want to buy. I'd like to buy some armor for the abstract strikers. Let's start with you and Rion. I arrived in Neon almost, uh, what, 20 years ago? I had gotten a job at Xenofresh through a friend and started working on the loading docks. After a few years, they moved me up to Kazimbas Processing, and that's where I met Rosa for the first time. She was my supervisor, but we hit it off right away. It wasn't long before we decided to quit Xenofresh, get married, and start our own business. We've been in love ever since. That's beautiful. I'd say the majority of the guards are rotten, and the few who aren't simply take a paycheck and look the other way. They have Neon completely under their control. The Freestar Collective's own security doesn't even maintain a presence here. If it wasn't for the Freestar Rangers outpost, there wouldn't be a shred of justice in this entire city. More like an outpost in a city. I like to go to think hers. No, I'll stick to this. Oh, dear lord. Did Briggs put you up to this? All these gangs are a menace. I don't want to have any part of it. I'll pay for it in cash right now. The strikers don't even, even have an even playing for this type of win. That's bad for everyone. Why won't you sell to them? Because they're bottom-feeding parasites. They steal and murder and security couldn't care less. Us businessmen have to draw a line somewhere. And this... They are definitely the lesser evil. All right, already. All right. You pay and I'll send Briggs his armor. But this is a one-time deal. I don't want anything to do with this madness after that. It doesn't. Given the circumstances, any discounts? That's not a discount. That's Rob. One, two, three, four, five, six. What do you take before nobody will pay that much? Who knows how long it'll be before another uh, you get another offer? Fine. Don't think I'm desperate or anything, but you do have a point. Not if I go. Sorry, I'm not trying to be difficult. I just want to talk this through. If you don't like it, no discount. Shit. I'll send the armor to Madame Savages. Now, Jane. Oh, yeah. Boost packs. Got those two. But Administrator Bay, you came by while you were out. Oh, yeah? His Majesty decided to come down from his throne and walk amongst us peasants? What did he want? He said he wanted to personally thank us for our contributions to the city and hopes for our continued support. I'm sorry. Our contributions? Those taxes we pay are a sham, so he can line his ivory trade tower with another layer of gold. Makes me sick. Newell's Goods, we have everything you could possibly want. Welcome to Newell's. Let me know if you need help with anything. Uh, nothing's wrong, you sound awfully tired. You're... Oh my, do I? That's awful. I should be taking better care of my customer. 
You'll have to excuse me. With all the ruckus my husband's been making at the Merchant Alliance meetings, it's difficult to get any rest. Poor old man has himself mixed up in a foolish crusade against Dietrich Sieghart, who he's angry at for paying off Neon security. You don't think Sieghart's doing anything wrong? I don't believe he is, no. I think my husband has Dietrich all wrong. He's probably doing what he has to do to survive. Just, um, please don't tell James I said that. I don't want him to think his own wife is doubting him. I'm gonna help your husband solve this problem. Does James know you don't agree with this crusade? I have no idea. Anytime the subject comes up, it turns into an argument. Frankly, he's so obsessed with this Dietrich situation, I don't think he's listening to me at all. Well, are you convinced that your husband's wrong? It's just a feeling that I have about Dietrich. I'm sure he's paying off Neon security because he has no choice. I can't afford to fight back like my husband expects. Hmm. Oh no. I'd hate for you to get sucked into the whole silly affair. It would be so lovely to see my James happy again. He used to smile at me all the time, you know. Now all I see is worry on his face. I suppose you can speak with him about it if you like. But perhaps you'd like to browse our store a bit before you do? Dietrich is actually quite a lovely man. Though lately he's been under a... When we first opened our business here in Akuchi Market, he was actually very helpful. Offered us advice. Didn't treat us like competition at all. I'm sorry, I just don't believe Dietrich is doing anything wrong paying off Neon security. We all do what we have to do to survive in this wretched city. Why don't you move to New Atlantis? my husband is convinced that fighting <laughs> City Hall is the way to solve all of Neon's problems. I think he's wrong. Oh, he'll be so upset for me telling you this. But James and I used to work on the Chasm Bass line at Xena Fresh. Bass, we didn't bass. do any of the Aurora extraction, just dealt with the leftovers. I was a supervisor on the line, and when the alarm went up that it had been stopped, I investigated. I find James inside a storage vat, up to his shoulders in stinky fish guts and blind as a bat. The gut got in his eyes, you see. I had to walk him to the showers, strip his work clothes, and hose him down. When he saw me standing there, he turned bright red. <laughs> <laughs> After the shift uh, ended, that's we hilarious. went out for a terror brew and talked. That's an endearing smile. A, a year little later, we were married. Creepy. <laughs> Better times. Better times. That would be lovely. Stop by again soon. If you have a, take your time.
Have a good day. I hope to God helping. I hope to God helping this. Oh. Okay. Fair enough. Just be careful when you're dealing with. The first time I brought up the subject, we got into a huge argument. Siegert said he had every intention of paying Neon security and that it was final. After that, I tried to speak to him a few times, but he's always been too busy to spend the time to sit down and have a decent. It's obvious he has no intentions of talking to me anymore. I honestly don't know what I did to make him so angry with me. No problem. Tell everyone you know about our store. Briggs is going to let me kick these disciples where it hurts. I've been telling him to let his best man loose for weeks. <laughs> you better believe it. Both of us worked for that hellhole Xenofresh way back. I was a casualty of a reduction in force. But Paul Briggs's leg got crushed in an accident. So Xenofresh, being the class act they are, they fired him. And later, even sued him. <laughs> you are something else. The plan's simple. We hit the street run as hard in as many points as possible. Maximum chaos. Then Andrea can waltz into their weapons cache, snag the big guns, <laughs> and then the re... Oh, it'll work. Here's three groups of street rats for you. Me and my boys will take some others. You're going, you're going into danger. Anything I can get you? Many don't. You can find corpses anywhere. I haven't no seen one. No one notices anymore. I haven't and seen the any. lucky ones, they have to sell themselves, their soul, beliefs, anything and everything. There is no hope here. Where do you get all the stuff you sell? The strikers steal all sorts of things. I handle the stat. Not sure why me, although I don't think anyone would trust Vogel or Andrea to do it. Of course. Stay safe. Yeah?
Can you believe Xenofresh charges us a license? Listen.
where they are. <laughs> we got the guns, new fish. Went in, pop, 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 and the cash is ours. Yeah, and that's thanks to me and my new best mate. <laughs> Hit any problems on your patrol? I'm not sure we're best mates. You're all good. Comrades in arms, then? Whatever, you did good. Everything's going according to plan, Briggs. Good. Now we hit them where it hurts. This warehouse is one of their main strongholds. Not going to lie. Taking it is going to be hard. Newfish, what's the play? Go in guns blazing? Stay out here and make sure I don't get interrupted. We rush them together. They won't know what hit them. You heard the plan. It's not much of a plan. Warehouse 3. Slow and smart, strikers. Everyone out. We will deal with them later. Shit! Stop the ringing! Uh, you better get out. Ah! Let's get this done. Now you'll see why people fear us! That's why they fear you. Playtime is over. Downstairs, now! I recognize that condescending tone anywhere. Hands off weapons. Damn it. You think Neon Security wouldn't know about what's going down? Please. Oh, Looks like you've done a bit of violence, a bit of murder. Word is, all of this is due to you. Why are you messing around with my streets, huh? I was doing your job, welcome. You would know the first thing about my job. You're taking bribes. So here's what's going to happen. Gang violence gets too noisy. That hurts the bottom line around here. No one affects the bottom line. Tell that to the disciples. No. I want you to, Mr. Briggs. The disciples have been pissing me off for far too long. So, your gang throws off Sewer Rat Blue and starts wearing Neon Security Black. Or, you can be found face down in the streets. Hey, and you an offer to get say your goodbyes. Legit jobs again Briggs to the gang members. Because you guys lost your job. Right one due to injury, one because of the cuts. Maybe I can find this address and surprising offer. The best way to fight gang violence is getting your own pet gang. Trust me. So that'd be like a subsection of Neon Security. The upside fighters. Setting street rad against street rad is pretty elegant, right? Don't take too long. Time to onboard the new hires. Good you're here. Huddle up, gang. Is this for real? They want me to be a a cop. Shit. 
We could get a real pad. Maybe even move out of Epside? Briggs, I'm so in. Hell yeah, Andrea. After all we've done, Neon Security seriously will let that go? I don't see why not. Do you really think anyone cares who stabs who in Ebside? What's your take? With the chance to get out of Ebside, take it. I can't believe how corrupt security is here. <laughs> no reason Owen would lie. The offer seems legit. That's Neon for you. Anyone object to going for the deal? That's good. Really good. I'll give Owen the news. I can't say I was expecting this. Whatever god or gods we please to get you to help us, know we'll be forever grateful. Cringe. Let's keep the disciples under control. Same to you. It looks like the strikers are retiring. And here's your cut. Damn. 15,000. Street sweeper added. Dr. Tavon. Stars. Street sweeper. Bull barrel reflex sight hair trigger. Lacerate. Randomly applies a bleed effect for the target. can leave this garbage dump. <laughs> Finally, I can leave this garbage dump. I still don't know what to think. Yeah, real job again. <laughs> I can't believe it. Where the, the hell did Briggs go? You All I owe you, we'll never forget. You guys did this? It's almost impressive. Almost. Manaya Adams was looking for someone discreet for a job. Manaya Adams. Apparently, I don't qualify. Another activity. Okay. What's next? Faction. Out of here. So we're done with the showdown. And with supply line. We'll stop it for here, guys. Please comment, subscribe, leave a like.
We'll continue with Neon's debacle next time. Peace.